What's up guys, what's going on? Camp Out coming at you with a review. Uh, I got these super fast. I ordered them from Pata Online. They had like a pretty dope checkout system where you just got in line and they emailed you to let you know uh, when your slot was like ready to go and if they had pairs left, you were able to purchase. So it was pretty easy. Uh, I ended up with a 10 and a half. Uh, what colors on here? Jelly 3, Birch, Burgundy, blah, 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 10.5. They do run a little snug, not gonna lie to you. Uh, I could have definitely went with the size 11. Uh, I don't mind my sneakers that snug, but these are a little close. They're kind of close. So I'm uh, just going to open it up and get right into it. As you can see, Gel Light 3. The colorway is not uh, a colorway I'm used to purchasing or going after, but I was so elated that I got through and it was so easy that I, I just pulled the trigger on them. They came a day later. Uh, pretty nice. They got. Uh, they say it's pigskin suede. It feels pretty soft, especially for a GR. These are not a Pata collaboration. They're just Pata exclusive. So let's just get that out of the way before we go any further. Pata exclusive, not Pata collaboration. Colorway's nice. Material is is soft. It's softer than any other GR. Like I have a couple of GRs, and the material is never really on point with them. This is much softer than most of the GRs that I do have. You get a good brush stroke on here. You guys can see me going back and forth on the uh, the toe cap there. Uh, we'll go over the colors real quick. You have a sand color on the toe box and the perforated um, suede. You got this brown color on the toe cap rolling into the medial side or the lateral side I should say. Uh, that brown stretches all the way into the heel counter, uh, the grommet area and the uh, for your laces and whatnot. You got your Asics logo in the burgundy with a 3M underlay. You can't see it here but yes it is 3M on the underlay which you typically don't get on a lot of GRs is that little extra hit or the extra detailing. So you got uh, you got the nice suede on here and you got a little extra detailing hit which is pretty pretty dope considering it is just a gr <clears throat> um you got that perforated sand color on the underlay of the asics logo rolling to the hill counter you got your green your sand and a uh like a nylon upper portion of the achilles area burgundy asics logo silver asics logo and that brush suede again in the uh where the heel window usually is rolling to the medial side same thing as the lateral side let me pull the other one out of the box i don't know why i didn't do that from jump street Bang, bang. So you got your lateral and down and your medial on the up. Uh, everything is mirrored, so nothing inverted, nothing different. Same colorways. Your ankle collar has got the, um, the nylon and it's nylon on both sides. Black footbed. Pretty easy. Pretty simple. Asics logo down there. Asics logo on the other one. And like I said, from the medial side, mirrored from the lateral side. So you got your burgundy. You got your 3M underlay. You got your sand. Uh, underlay with the perforations and uh, your green colorway. So, I mean, pretty simplistic. No extra laces. Midsole's all white on both sides. Outsole is black, burgundy, and black. Pretty simple. The only extra that you got on here was the uh, Pata exclusive little like keychain joint, which I never put on my keys, but it is what it is. I'll do an on for you guys real quick and uh, call it a day. If you're not subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or comments, hit me in the comment section. Uh, if you're worried about sizing, I would definitely go 0.5 up. 0.5 up, half a size up, if you're not sure what 0.5 up means, but definitely go a half a size up on these. Um, even if you do like a snugger fit, half a size will not mess you up at all. Anyway, I'm getting out of here. Peace.